Here we are at the cottages of Scenic Highway 11. We're up here located in Salem, South Carolina. We're only about a half a mile from the Cliffs Falls entrance south and north gate to give you an idea. We're only about three miles from uh, Lake Jocasse to get up there at Devil's Fork State Park. And we're only within about a mile and a half of Falls Creek Landing on the north end of Lake Kiwi. So you can see why we have such a great location here. You've got two of the prettiest lakes in the southeast and you're less than three, four miles from Lake Landings of both lakes. Um, these units, uh, as you can see, are not not large, but they're they're great inside. You've got one bedroom, a full bath, uh, living room area, and also a kitchen. So certainly can be utilized for anyone overnight stay. If you want to stay weekly, uh, nightly for a month or you know long term any of those options are there and again you got to remember about the great location one thing I can hear as I'm standing here there's a beautiful creek that runs along down the back and so we always hear running water from these so if you want to really have a nice relaxing afternoon just sit out on the front porch and enjoy that but uh, let's head on inside take a look one other thing I want to mention about the location before we go inside is that a half a mile from here you have a market grocery store it's more like a fresh market a hardware store so again a uh, great location and very convenient to those types of items because they would sell fresh meat seafood wines they've got a great wine list in there uh, for sale and along with um, they even serve more like a deli style sandwiches and that type of thing so great place the market and again if you've ever been to a fresh market you're going to enjoy that let's head on inside and take a look All right, feels great in here. Um, these units, as I said, we've got a living room area here. This is a fold out, probably about the size, a little bit bigger really than a queen size bed, but pretty good size uh, there. And um, kitchen, here you can see we also have lofted ceilings. They're all wood. We have pine upstairs. Little eating area over here beside me kitchen, new appliances, everything set up from a toaster oven to a microwave and a uh, little back deck area off this and then bathroom we have solid stone countertops same in the kitchen you got your shower tub set up and then the bedroom over to the side queen size bed in here and then also washer dryer hookups which we will have a washer dryer there so and then you've got a little closet area here where also located the hot water heater and again vaulted ceilings in this room so nice setup uh, convenient again location great getaway if you want some privacy that certainly has it I'll tell you what let's head from here let's go out the back and we'll listen for that waterfall that I was talking about earlier because that's one of the things I love most about this property is the the serenity that you have behind you here and the sound of that running water now you can see why we were excited about the water sound from the uh, cabin because man it doesn't get any prettier than this uh, that's like your own little sliding rock and we're probably not more than a couple hundred feet from the back of the cabins with a trail coming down to this property and uh, just absolutely beautiful i mean the water is cool coming straight out of the mountains you've got this little sandbar out here but just a great place to get down here and relax and enjoy. I'm looking around as I see this uh, rhododendron that when it gets this large, it's been here for years and years and years and really untouched. So you don't find uh, nature any better than this. And uh, if you're not into this, I don't care who you are, you're crazy because this is awesome. Speaking of awesome, well here we are at Devil's Fork State Park as you look out over this wonderful Lake Joe Cassie, absolutely beautiful mountains in the background. You've got to remember 37,000 acres of Joe Cassie Gorgeous property up and around this lake that will never ever be developed. So this is absolutely awesome. And we're just a couple minutes, uh, probably about five minutes actually, from the uh, cottages there at Scenic 11. So uh, again, to have uh, an amenity like this so close, it's just sheer awesome. We 
we look back over here, you'll see a covered area during the summer. You can lay out in the sun. Actually, there's some folks out there today, uh, and you've got rentals for uh, kayaks, uh, different things like that. So just a great setup out here. They even have a little um, a convenience store at the top of the hill behind us, which certainly is very convenient anytime you have uh, items that you need right here at the lake. And from here, I tell you what, we're going to head over to Fall Creek Landing on the north end of Kiwi. Give you an idea of what that's all about and how close that is also. Take in the beauty. Here we are at Fall Creek Landing. We're just a mile and a half away, again, from the cottages up there on the scenic highway. As we look around, you'll see there's a sandy beach down below us, and right before we started this video, we just saw some fish feeding on top of the water, so that was pretty cool. Um, all around us here on the north is part of the cliff property. As we swing on around, you'll see the landing area. Got some folks out here been fishing today. And then up here to the left is an island, which uh, we just call that jumping off rock. But a lot of people, as you can see where that boat is, will go up onto that rock and dive off or jump, do flips, whatever. Actually, some people out there enjoying it today. So again, great location for these rentals. Uh, gives you, you know, all the amenities have to offer on Lakes Kiwi and Jocassi, and you need to come take advantage of them.